starting off, we got the Emperor, mm, the Magician, shit, and the Nine of Cups. Golly, what you cooking over there? Shit, is it potluck? <laughs> <clears throat> is it potluck? Shit. Do I get to bring a dish? Ace of Wands. <laughs> oh, do I get to bring a dish to potluck? <laughs> oh, Wheel of Fortune. Oh, shit. What's clarifying the Nine of Cups? The Lovers. Yeah, we definitely get it in the studio. Absolutely. Mm -hmm. Come through, Divine Masculine. You got the Emperor. You got the Wheel of Fortune. Clarified by Divine Masculine's energy. Holy shit. Okay, I don't know what you cooking today, but it smells good. What's the Magician and the Ace of Wands? You said you needed a creative spark? Mm, Roger that. <laughs> Roger that. You said you needed some excitement? <laughs> okay magician a swans bear okay immediately what i heard was bear market okay short gains may be significant all right mm. that may be a message for you that may not be i don't know what your <clears throat> side ventures are but you may want to pay attention to that nine of cups and the lovers what is this what is this Clouds in reverse. You're getting clarity now. You're getting clarity now of a situation. Okay? Or you will be in the very near future. All right? What is this? You're getting clarity now. Mm-hmm. Divine masculines in the collective. You are spiritually gifted and you've chosen to do great things. Did you just figure out how to use your gifts for something like, did you just level up spiritually? Is that what happened? Truth is, you're not the only one. There may be multiple divine masculines act activating, or you may be getting new spiritual gifts, or you're leveling up your gifts in some kind of way. Damn, divine masculines. Okay. Divine masculines. What? <clears throat> yeah. Mm -hmm. It's like a... It's like a podcast about audiobooks in a library because your thoughts is loud. You 10 moves ahead on something, okay? You 10 moves ahead on something. Divine Masculine, there's going to be a lot of evil eye. Make sure you load up on salt. Salt is what's going to block that evil eye, okay? Divine Masculine, get your salt, okay? Salt is definitely significant because it's going to be a lot. It's going to be a lot of motherfuckers hating. Okay? They already hating Divine Masculine. They already hating. People expected you to be in your feelings. Maybe you are, right? But you need to use that as fuel. You need to use that as fuel. Okay? Because against all odds, you may be taking action against some odds today. That's going to work in your favor, baby. Okay, make sure you got your lucky rabbit's foot. Okay. Mm. My master, what are you doing? Yeah. Temperance. You need to pay attention to the subtle hints of nature. I'm telling you, whatever this is, you may feel like so <laughs> there may even be someone in your ear or somebody popping shit. I don't know what's what this is, Divine Masculine Collective. You may think that you're not making the right moves, but you actually are. You're 10 moves ahead in some kind of situation here that may be against all odds. Okay, temperance. One foot on the ground, one in the water. Mm, what you mixing up, Divine Masculine? What you mixing up, Divine Masculines? Success. Six of Pentacles. Shit. Divine Masculines, what are y'all doing? <laughs> Divine Masculines, what are y'all doing? 
equal give and take. Divine masculines, you're 10 moves ahead. What are you doing? What are you doing, Divine Masculines? Okay. Theta waves. You could be meditating. What are you doing, Divine Masculines? Okay. You 10 moves ahead. Okay. As far as temperance energy, you definitely making sure that that foot that's in the water is touching all three of these houses. Something significant about your natal chart. Fourth house which is family, eighth house, which is transformation, 12th house, which is sacrifice. Okay, so you could be balancing out something. Balancing out something. This could be your time. This could be your efforts. This could be your portfolio. Take what resonates because you got pentacles here. You got earth and water, okay? Mm, pay attention to... Yeah, I'm telling you, some of y'all definitely leveled up because you're getting two spiritual gift cards now this new gift is special and must be cherished whatever gift god just blessed you with don't abuse it divine masculine okay you may feel like you want to right <laughs> don't do it don't do it just just trust me when i tell you god damn it divine masculine don't abuse your spiritual gift that's how it's gonna multiply Right? You want to use this new spiritual gift, yes, to your advantage, but not bringing harm to anyone, at least your intentions, right? Because if something happens, you know, that's not, that's beyond you. God is not going to fault you for that, but <clears throat> he is going to judge you. All right? So be mindful. Be mindful. Okay? Yep. Temperance is getting clarified by angelic assistance is present. Okay, your angels is trying to guide you in the right direction, divine masculine. You need to protect yourself. There's snakes in your circle, which means that, I mean, you could be very aware of who these snakes are already. This is any sign. This is general divine masculine collective. Okay, the universe may be intuitively showing you who these damn snakes are. Okay, you need to protect yourself. It may not be um, based off of what... It's like the minute people see you doing good, despite their many attempts to try to attack you, Divine Masculine, that's when that, that ugly green eye monster come out, okay? Somebody evil eye in you, Divine Masculine, all right? And as much as you want to be, maybe a former part of yourself used to be a people pleaser, but you in this upgrade energy you getting activated and once you in alignment that comes with the territory of being being chosen baby that's just what it is but let's not look at the cups that's spilt okay i'm intuitively seeing five of cups in my third eye let's not look at the cups that spilled because you got two cups in the upright and they flowing they filled up so you're gonna turn around from this five of cups and you're gonna get in your temperance energy look there go the two cups we was talking about. And you're like, okay, bet. I'm going to keep one foot on the ground and I'm going to dip this toe in the water. Okay, use my intuition on what's coming. Right, because balance. And you was like, that's okay. I ain't even worried about them stinking three cups because I got these two cups right here, baby. Exactly. Okay, exactly. Now you know why you needed to reprogram your mindset because as you continue to raise your vibration, you're naturally going to dis dissonate from things that no longer serve you. It's not something that there may be times where you miss whatever that is, but you know where God is trying to take you. Everything can't come with you. And that's just how it is. You know, there's still times where I think about those days too, right? But had I not made those changes in my life and let go and let God, right? Stop clinging, self no energy to what just feels good or what I'm comfortable with and fully embracing North Node energy and just, it's like, it's literally full energy. It's like you taking a dive. Most people be like, oh no, full energy is childish and risky. They don't know how to read tarot. It depends on what comes out with it. Full in the upright means taking calculated risks that work in your favor. If it comes out in the reverse, that means that you missed an opportunity to make a, uh, taking a calculated risk. 
that would have worked in your favor. But I'm also hearing scare money don't make money. I don't know what you're doing, Divine Masculine Collective, but you, you need to trust your intuition. Okay? There's definitely somebody in regards to these snakes in your circle that's trying to drain you. Drain you of your energy. Drain you of your creativity. I don't know. Somebody is trying to throw you off your game. Whoever this is in your life. All right? Whoever this person is in your life could be intently spying on you. This person could be watching you, watching you on your social media, watching you on your phone, or shit. They could be spiritually stalking you. I don't know. Okay? This person could literally be watching you sleeping. Though. This person is the vibe that's like, they ass is toxic. Okay? <laughs> they watching you sleep. <laughs> shit okay this is this is because this person um has trust issues absolutely okay for divine masculines that's in relationships somebody i don't know i don't know who this is okay you need to teach them how to love baby because they don't know how to love trust love is trust okay even when things ain't going the way you want them to love is forgiveness Love is a lot of things, okay? But love is not that. Love is not supposed to be toxic. Somebody is bound to some kind of patterns here, okay? If whoever this is, Divine Masculine, if they watching you sleeping, that's kind of spooky, bruh. Okay, I'm just going to let you know, okay? 